historically, when we look at what happened in the last 10 years, the trend is that companies do tend to go to the capital areas. When we assess like why are uh, companies moving to like capital regions is, is always um, A, like access to talent and then funding. So they always run into financial and they need to, to grow and scale their business. And uh, the, the majority of the, the funding instruments and organizations are located in, uh, in capital regions. And the same happens here in Finland. So. There is a big concentration in, in metropolitan Helsinki area. About half, a bit more than half of the uh, startup companies are based in, in uh, this area. But there are also quite big uh, concentrations of startup hubs in uh, Finland, city of Tampere and city of Turku. The city of Tampere, uh, which is, uh, has very strong industrial background, so the city has been focused on manufacturing industries. And also uh, there's a strong uh, technical university in, in that area that plays an important role. And one key feature of that area is, is um, different kind of activities in which uh, bigger companies bring their ideas to maybe students and other startup companies to, to solve out. So that is kind of the key feature of, of Tampere area. Helsinki has some advantages over Tampere. First of all, it's a lot bigger. Than, than Tampere is. So it means they have more resources, uh, 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 more capabilities and, and more money. So what we need to do is not to mimic or copy what Helsinki is doing, but find our own path and do what we are best of doing. A Business Tampere is an economic development uh, organization um, owned by the Tam city of Tampere and the surrounding municipalities. And, and then the main mission is provide services, facilitate the growth. So we build networks with investors, with the innovation hubs, with corporations, uh, with other relevant organizations, and, and, and based on the needs of different uh, scale up and startups. The whole idea behind Platform 6 project is to really be the epicenter of all the startup activity in Tampere. And as we are uh, a new uh, startup ecosystem, that is still growing, right? Platform 6 is like the foundation of something bigger that we want to be building. Uh, it, it is important that there is this concentration of uh, the startups, but as well all the organizations that support startups being the same building. But of course, Platform 6 is more than the building, is building the connections uh, to the investors, corporates, um, reaching out to talent, and not only on a national level, but uh, international level as well. In smaller cities, in, in small towns, that people will kind of like move to, not necessarily the capital area, but, but the, the bigger cities. Uh, but as far as, as to being in Tampere, I don't think there is, there is that much sense of urgency anymore. Uh, there is a, a very vivid startup community here, which is starting to grow and, 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 and become established. There seems to be a lot more students interested in, in startups because they see this as, uh, as an opportunity to, to kind of have a, like an influence on, on the world on their own terms or to focus on, on their true passions. City of Turku, yes, and, and that is also, they have very strong uh, university and research background and especially in the healthcare sector. We are very uh, kind of entrepreneurship and startup friendly places all, all over Finland. And, and, and in Turku we have kind of the hub for startup things and, and Turku Science Park works with all, all, all startups and all companies from zero to the phase where they go uh, kind of uh, abroad. So I, I'd say that, uh, you know, we have enough enough of a good a place to work and, and compared to Tampere or Helsinki. The support uh, the startups get in Turku, I think Turku is really excellent city for that. Uh, the city of Turku is uh, investing heavily in helping all kinds of ideas to become uh, businesses and com companies. And then the journey from 
starting the company, starting to build your product, but also uh, creating the business out of it and going international. The city of Turku provides a lot of support for startups and founders. Boost is an entrepreneurship society that since 2009, it has been accelerating entrepreneurship in Turku. We focus on helping people along their journey to speed them up in their process, to guide them along the right paths and get them where they want to be. We're famous around all of Finland and we constantly come up with new ideas on what to do to improve the entrepreneurship here in Finland. We don't look at things the way that everybody else does, but rather try to find new things to really focus on our customers, so the startup entrepreneurs. Here uh, we are in SparkUp. SparkUp is, is the community for the startups. For all uh, startup uh, uh, related or startup uh, attitude people as well. So you don't uh, need uh, necessarily to be a, a startup founder, but uh, you can be a talent looking for a startup or you can be an investor looking for a next company to invest in or to support the growth. So the startup SparkUp community is much more than only this physical place where we are at the moment. I've been to Tampere now a couple of times. They are very much boosting their local uh, ecosystem and uh, startup ecosystem to create more jobs there locally. Cities are now kind of uh, creating their own own ecosystem with what Helsinki had done already here for for 10 years ago. So now everybody else understands that this is where the new growth comes, where the new people to the city comes, that there are jobs and there are possibilities and there are growth and, and, and places. Uh, each region in Finland, they have their own smart specialization strategies. So they, they are really focusing on those uh, regional strengths, whether they are bioeconomy or the ICT sector or, or other, other sectors. And that draws that, that a different kind of uh, public funding projects kind of uh, uh, take, take the uh, development in the same direction within a region. There's a lot of activity in regional centers and a lot of talent and a lot of investments and, and this, this is a trend that we see very positive and this kind of startup uh, development is very important also for the uh, development of regional uh, expertise and, and, and the regional strengths.